Hey guys, this is Tim bringing you another YC Weekly, and today's topic is about internet challenges. What is it with these crazy internet challenges? Have we really gotten to the point where we're eating laundry detergents for giggles? Or are they supposed to clean our digestive system? Cause... Crazy challenges have existed way before the internet era. In the early 1900s, people would watch food eating competitions such as hot dog eating competitions, pizza eating competitions, and pie eating competitions for strange amusement. The people doing these challenges wanted to gain recognition and a sense of thrill. As of right now, no more eating cookies and hot dogs. It's the Kylie Jenner challenges, ice bucket challenges, and Tide Pod challenges. These challenges have become infamous for being so crazy, but are extremely dangerous for our health. Speaking of Tide Pods, the most recent challenge on the internet, the Tide Pod challenge, has sent many people to the hospital. Tide Pods are extremely dangerous and lethal especially since they meant to wash clothes, like... Are teenagers actually just doing this to gain popularity on social media? Or is it more to it? I really wanna to get to the bottom of this. Why are people eating Tide Pods? This is not even a challenge. Other challenges too, like the Chubby Bunny challenges, the Kylie Jenner challenge, Kylie Jenner, like, come on, Kylie Jenner? Then you got the, the Cinnamon Challenge, Hot Chili Pepper Challenge, come on, come on. Yo, bro. Have you heard of the penny challenge? It's like so radical. Nah, man, I'm vegan. I don't do no more internet challenges. I, I just turned vegan. I can't do it no more. What? Yeah, man. The cinnamon challenge. I did the cinnamon challenge. All right, we had to consume a tablespoon worth of cinnamon and I choked. The saliva wasn't flowing well and my boy was choking too. He had to go to the hospital. I tried calling the police and I couldn't because I was choking. Then you have the Kylie Jenner challenge where teenagers are sucking the shot glasses and making their lips bigger to look like Kylie Jenner. This has caused serious bruising and scarring on the lips due to the loss of blood circulation. Last but not least, we have the Chubby Bunny challenge where people stuff as many marshmallows in their mouth and say the words Chubby Bunny. People have actually choked and possibly died off of this challenge. And that wraps it up for this week's YC Weekly. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe on our YouTube channel and follow us on other social media platforms. And please, please think before you do these challenges. I'm not telling you to not do it, but please be careful.